Tis another day to LP. Welcome back, everybody. See, I'm, I'm trying to make the Lorimes work. It's... Hmm. Welcome, Ed. Hundred eighty five degrees. Scan for any anomalies. Scan for any anomalies. Scan for any anomalies. Scan for any anomalies. There. Result. Whatever the hell that is. That's it! The vault must be there on basement floor 8. Anna wanted me to go with her to the family's grave to see what Dr. Morales meant about the key. I should ask her about it before we go any further. Um, uh, Anna? Anna? Hi. Um, uh... Anna, I don't want to pressure you because I know this is hard, but are you ready to go over to the cemetery? Let's go. Yes, of course. I'm ready. We're doing pretty well here, folks. I haven't been here in a long time. These are my parents. I didn't know they were here, too. My mother died when I was a young girl. After that, everything was different. My father started drinking. 1963 to 1994? I'm so scared of him. I try not to think about those days. A year after my mother's death, he fell down our basement stairs and broke his neck. Damn it, I missed the other one. 1959 yeah. to 96? I hoped that I could live with Uncle Javi. I was very close to him, but he disappeared from my life after my father died. I was raised by my grandparents. My father and Uncle Javi had one other brother, Angelo. Alright. Angelo, what are, you, what are your dates looking Here like? He, is. he died before I was 51 born. 51 to 87. I didn't even know much about him. Was his middle name Key? No, it was... it was Ray. The stone is worn. Could that be the clue? Your uncle holds the key? I don't know. Well, it's all we've got. We'll have to figure it out by the time we get to the vault. Ed, thank you for coming here with me. I... Sure. You're welcome. We should go. There you are. We've been waiting. So, did we find it or what? I think so. Using the lab's thermal scanner and the information from Tortoise, I found what I think is the vault's location. It's in the tunnels beneath the lab's decommissioned super collider. Far underground. So how do we get in? There are several service and ventilation shafts that go from the surface down to the super collider. Using the blueprints, I was able to find one that should get us close to the vault room. It's here. Not far from here. The super collider passes underground. The lock looks pretty old. We should be able to break it and climb down. Climb? So this is it? Almost. Come on. Let's get this over with. Aww. Aww. What is this? We're in a service tunnel underneath Juno's old super collider. 
The vault room should be a uh, hundred meters down this hallway. How do we get through? I didn't know the way would be blocked. They must have been using the crates to salvage pieces of this collider for the newer one. We'll have to find a way to move them. Move them? This particle accelerator used powerful magnetic fields to bend the trajectory of highly accelerated particles. We should still be able to start up the magnets in the ceiling to clear a path. Damn it, Ed, was that even in English? Us use big magnets, box go to sky. Do we still need this mope? <laughs> yes. I hurt my shoulder when I was a kid. Accident with a truck motor and a climbing frame. Long story. Anyways, having a metal shoulder around powerful magnetic fields is a bad idea. You three will have to clear a path for me. So, I'll hold anything you're carrying in case it's got metal in it. You mean my gun? Yeah, that sort of thing. Under no circumstances does an officer hand anyone else his weapon. I'm staying with Ed. Here, you can hold everything I'm carrying. To tell you the truth, I'm a bit weighed down too. Including right, your password cracker and... ...are highly focused and only affect the marked areas. Bennett and I can't be in one of those sections while the magnet is on, but you two should be fine. We'll support you however we can. She wearing earrings? I think those are earrings. Earrings are a bad idea, Anna. A a I, I, I can't tell if that's hair or earrings, but if that's earrings, that's... That's gonna hurt like a son of a gun. I'm just saying. Oh, did I flip it off? Alright. So you can actually go into here while it's on, can you? Or can you go into there while it's on? Uh, right. Okay. So, Raimundo. Release it while you're right underneath it. Lols. Let's climb up the ladder. If I release it. Gotcha. Okay. Mr. Ed, we're gonna bring you up here. Anna, you can release. You're going to walk through this. Because Ed is going to lift it up for you. I raise it all. Alright, so we're going to have you walk through here. <laughs> Drop the crate on her. Walls! I mean, what I can obviously do then is go up. Oh, interesting. Okay, everyone needs to be together before we leave.
Okay. Well, Raimundo, release it. Okay. Anna. Okay, that's not what we want. We need to go back over to Lord Eddard Stark and release this. Now we're good. Now Anna is going to press this. Beautiful. Lord Stark. You're going to go across here. Oh, wow. Well, I should really have Detective following you. So you two are up here. There is no ladder though. Right? Right. So we have to get them all down. So we're going to release this. But how- oh, yeah, I do see how you would do that. So what we want then is for you to hit the super magnet. Oh, but Anna's still up there. Hmm. Oh, you know what? No, I do know how to do it, I think. Oh! Oops. Oops. Let's just walk you out of the way of that, shall we? Someone has to be up here. Let's bring Ed across. Puzzle's actually a little bit more... I'm wondering if the puzzles in this game are as complex as I think they are, or whether I'm just kind of like, derping it out. So we want Anna then. We want you over here to... We're gonna bring you down. And right. We're gonna... Oops, have you switched that on? Anna. So what we want now... We actually do want it like that, I think. Because then what we want to do... That is on.
Right. Now Ray. You're going to release this. Um, Anna, you're going to make that go. Detective. We're going to have you come across. How do I get you guys down, though? Oh, I know. I think I get it. Alright, now we're going to raise that. Oh, wait, no, we don't want them both. We want the opposite of that. We want the opposite of what I just did. We want you guys both over here. And down the down the ladder. Yeah, <laughs> getting confused on like exactly what I want here, but I I think I've got it. A little bit tricky. Fun puzzle though. All right. The goal was to get the door controls up, down to the bot or the uh, bridge controls at the bottom as opposed to the top. Now that we have that, we're going to release that. We're going to ray you up. Now we're going to bring you down. Now, ray, you're going to power off the magnet. And that's it. Hey, bent it, right? Yeah. Come on. Okay. Hey, it's fine. Follow me. Yeah. Bam. The golf of toes knows how to go. Now that we're past the magnets, can we have our things back? Fine. I still think she was wearing earrings. Would have ripped her ears right out of there. Uh... That must be my uncle's vault, behind the glass. There are some papers here. Your uncle holds the key. The frig? Looks like this is for you. Huh? There's another scrap of paper stuck to the back. He's following me. Detective Winston Bennett. Okay. What is this? What are you looking at me for? Detective. The hell? Detective Bennett, were you or were you not following Dr. Morales in the days before his death? No. I had no idea who the old guy was until yesterday. I knew he was up to something. You stay out of this, asshole. That note you dropped last night? It all makes sense now. You wouldn't know sense if it punched you in your damn nose. Ed, Anna, I've put my career in jeopardy to help you guys. Last night, when Ed found you waiting outside my apartment, were you really just worried about me? Or did you have something to do with that man who was after me? Of course not. Bennett, give me your gun. Fuck you. Give him the gun, detective. Ed? Oh! Ed, grab his gun! That should hold him when he comes to. Raymond, is he...? He'll be alright. I just don't understand. Why would he? Anna, I know this is hard, but it's almost over. The vault is right there on the other side of that window. We need to get that door open and do what we came here to do. Dr. Morales is counting on us.
police. Uh... I wonder if Morales made any more notes on this pad. A small box. Okay. What's in the small box? There's a fuse in the box. Dear Liza, dear Liza. Anna has the... Your uncle holds the key. What the hell is... Ed, you want to try and... Ah, shit, wrong button. Fuse? It's just light. Sticking my finger in it doesn't do much. Carbon paper. One, three, two, two, one, three, three. Oh no, there's... Rip that little crap piece off! That could be an 8. That could be an 8 or a 3. Unfortunately... Controls for the bar seem to be locked out. Okay. I mean, this is the only other... I don't know why the two fuses look different, though. Fuse panel, pad of paper... All the pages are blank, you know, except for this unbelievably important code. Wait, wait, did that say something on the bottom? No. I don't get it. It doesn't seem like there's anything we can do to interact with this.
Put a screwdriver in there. That's not what I want to do. That's two. Okay. One. We're still missing one. Maybe he's carrying something useful. Did you find anything? We have everything from him that could be useful. Badge, credit card, blueprints. Um. What can I? What do you think we should do next? Uncle Javi wouldn't have asked us to come all the way here only to leave a metal door in our way. Well, folks, looks good enough for me for now. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. Tune into the next episode of Resonance. Thanks for watching, everybody.